today I'm going to show you how to install add-on weapons. I'll be using one that isn't 5 and ready created by this person and one that is 5 and ready created by this person. I hope you enjoy the video. The first weapon I'll be using is this rubber gun from GTA5Mods.com. It's semi-auto and does no damage, so I'll start the process to make it 5 and ready. Go into your server resources and create a folder. I'm going to call it weapons in brackets. The brackets are important if you want to put multiple weapons in the folder. Once you've created it, go inside and make a new folder for the weapon you're installing. I'm going to call it rubber gun. And once you've created that folder, go inside again and create two new folders, one called stream and one called meta. Then create a text document and call it cl underscore weapon names dot lua and then it'll change. Just click yes to accept it. Once you've created this Lua file, open it up. We're going to add After you've added the text, hit File and Save. And the last thing you need to add in the folder is the FX Manifest. I have it on my desktop here. You can create your own or you can use this one. That'll be in my Discord. So I'll go ahead and put this off to the side for now. Then download the weapon. So I'll close this for now. Once it's done, open it up and I'm going to drag this onto my desktop. Then open OpenIV or Open4. So once that opens, go into edit mode. Open the folder and drag the DLC RPF in. Close out of that. Then open the folder you created for the weapon and just put it off to the side. So I'll go in here first. And I'll move this over. Copy the metas and put them in the meta folder. And go back out. And these will go in the stream folder. And that's all you need to do to make it 5 and ready. I'll go ahead and show the process for the one that's already 5 and ready, which is basically drag and drop. The second weapon I'll be using is this paintball gun. As I previously stated, it's already 5 and ready, so hit the green code and download zip. Once it's done, open it up. Then open the weapons folder and just drag that in. Now, one thing you need to make sure to do is ensure the folder. So go to your server CFG and we'll ensure the folder. Then hit file and save. We'll then move on to adding them as items and such to make them work in the server. So go back to your resources, into the QB folder, find QB core, open the shared folder and open the items.lua. Now I'm just going to copy a random weapon to use as a template. And I'm going to add these all the way at the bottom. So I'll paste this and then start renaming the information. For the rubber gun, I'm going to change the ammo to SMG. And I'm going to use an image that's already there for the micro SMG. And for the description, I'm just going to put rubber gun. Then I'll paste the first one I copied again and start renaming it for the paintball weapon.
After you've added them, hit File and Save. Then go back to that shared folder and open the weapons.lua. Now in here, I'm going to do the same thing. So I'll copy this one. And I'm going to add the new ones at the end. So I'll start with the rubber gun. And then repeat the process for the paintball weapon. Now after you've added them, hit file and save, but move on to the next step. Next, go back to the QB folder and find QB weapons. Then open the config. And you need to add them in this section first. So I'll add them at the bottom by copying the last one and pasting it. I'll do the rubber gun first. And then I'll do it again for the paintball weapon. The paintball weapon has attachment compatibility, which is the clip. So I'll add it in this section here. So I'll copy the last one and paste it and start renaming the information. Right, then hit file and save. Then go back to the QB folder again and find QB small resources. Go into the client section and the first one will be the weapon draw. So you just need to add them to this list. So again, I'll copy the last one, hit enter and paste and rename the information. And then once more for the paintball. Then hit file and save. Next, go back to the client folder within QB Small Resources. It should already be open. And find the recoil.lua. Then open it up. You need to add them in here. I'm going to add them at the end. So I'll copy this one here. Paste it and rename it. Then hit File and Save. Next, go back to the QB folder and find QB Jewelry. And open the config. This section is for weapons players can use to smash the display cases while doing the robbery. So if you want the weapon you added to do this, add it here. So I'll do this as an example and just add the rubber gun to this option. And once you've added everything you want, hit File and Save. Then go back to the QB folder and find QB Ambulance Job. Open the config and scroll down. This deals with the damage. So I'm going to copy the last one. Hit enter and paste, and again start renaming the information.
and I've set these both to none. After you've added them, hit file and save. The next step deals with the alerts for PS dispatch and shooting. You can disable alerts for the weapon or add it to the list. I'll show the disabling option first. So go to your resources and find PS dispatch. Go into the shared folder and open the config. Then scroll down to this section here. And I'll copy this last one and paste it again. And I'm going to disable the alerts for the paintball gun. Then hit file and save. Now to add them to the list, go back to PS Dispatch, go into the client folder, and open the utils.lua. Then scroll down to this section here. And I'm gonna add And after you've added it, hit file and save, then you can start your server and test it out. If you're looking for hosting, check out One of One Servers. One of One Servers is a cutting edge VPS and dedicated server provider specializing in top notch features like reliable network, unlimited player slots, and advanced DDoS protection. They also offer 24 7 customer support so you can get help when you need it. Use the link in the description to check out all the features and get started. Now back to the video. I'm in the server now, so I'll start with the rubber gun, so I'll go ahead and pull it out. And put some bullets in it. Hey. Can't wait to have that drink next weekend. So we get the alert and as you can see it just says rubber gun. And they won't die, they'll just keep getting up. So I'll go ahead and go to the jewelry store. Ah! And go ahead and start smashing the case. Alright, and that's about it for that one. So I'll move on to the paintball weapon now. I'll pull it out. And load some ammo into it. That's how it sounds, and I'll go ahead and put the attachment on. And if you go to the weapon, you'll see that it is there. That'll be all for the video. If you enjoyed it and it helped you out, please leave a like and a sub. If you have any suggestions, feel free to comment down below or join my Discord. The link will be in the description. Thank you for watching. Oh.